Jimbo, I, I saw that you that you heard me complaining about um, uh, Matthew McConaughey and how your complaints were inaccurate to what he's actually doing, when instead he's like a Lincoln car advertisement, he just is the face value of a bunch of things that you're not assuming, so then you had to make it again where you said, oh man, my Lincoln car, you know, it's so secure, it's so safe, I don't even feel the need to lock it, you know, like I said in the parking lot, he's like that type of retard, as if his fanciness will save him from theft and logic, while well, he's not fancy at all, just because he goes, right? Yeah. So, uh, you know, him being an idiot and having, like, talked about, like, like, like his actual thoughts, of course, you wouldn't actually hear them. That's why he had to play them, because it was my whole conversation. Like, you already knew. Uh, it's the whole... He doesn't even know what world he's in, yet he's still being an asshole. That's why you were wrong, Jim Carrey. Because he doesn't know to mock somebody properly. He's like so cactusy. He's so much like a peyote addict. He like is the peyote that he's like a misbehaving cactus, like I was saying. He's like, I don't know what world I'm in. The you know, are you in my brain? Am I imagining you? Or are you imagining me? So the continuation of this, I forgot what I was you know, going to say was the continuation of this. Oh, would be to make fun of how what? He's being elected to basically be a representation of everybody's desire to go control and be greedy about money. That's what he's trying to run for in his local state. And Ryan Reynolds is also trying to run for that? Yeah. So maybe he should mock both of them at the same time. Yeah. You know? yeah. yeah. Because I'm sick of everybody showing off money. Like, I'm the one who came up with the whole raining confetti dollar bill cannons for a New Year, or I mean a Christmas movie, but he completely subverted the plot of the movie to just be negative. Yeah, when it's supposed to be, fuck New York. Yeah, always. The end. Always and forever. It's time to pull out the big guns and have Ryan Gosling be the guy making fun of Ryan Reynolds. Like, in whatever skit where he's interacting with, you know, fake cactus fuck. Yeah, and remember Jim Carrey. Ryan Gosling has ADHD, don't be mean. Yeah. Or I'll fucking slap you. Unless he's being a piece of shit about money, then... Yeah. That's it's... what you need to do to him if he fucking, fucking, fucking thinks he gets to control fucking money. Yep. I always tell people it's a representation of things. And uh, they like that concept of controlling it all through pieces of paper, but then they don't actually want to think through that it's made out of special hemp set up by George yeah, Washington. Yeah, McConaughey is basically just go wild cats in a costume yeah. for the concept of governors that take the blow f of every bit of uh, greed of all the populace yes. for fucking me over and not giving me money. So Fuck as the Matthew system gets supposedly better as we make headway with actual activities for humanity to do through our movies, then immediately they try to switch as though, yes, instead of being elected for actually different areas, because there's less people because of coronavirus in areas, then now you're being elected to be the bad for everyone else, like communist, like cheating, you know, like dial-up Wi-Fi or connection or some bullshit. I don't think so. Like, stop. Stop pretending politics is important so you can be more... Villainous. Villainous, yes. That's about all that I can say. Let me turn this off.